Rev. Dr. Ken Gordon, Spiritual Leader of Centers for Spiritual Living. Hello, welcome to Centers for Spiritual Living. My name is Rev. Dr. Ken Gordon and I'm the spiritual leader of this organization. I'm here today to just uh, fill in some information that perhaps might help you if you're looking for a spiritual home. Centers for Spiritual Living has some very dedicated ideas and thoughts as to how the world can be transformed. It is our purpose in life to awaken humanity to its spiritual magnificence and it is our vision to create a world that works for everyone. We intend on doing this through putting forward tools to help the individual and the world itself in determining and developing a global consciousness to transform this world. It is our experience that uh, what the world needs right now is a greater idea and a larger idea than the one that they've had before. That idea, simply put, is one that brings compassion into the world and brings education into the world, highlighting the understanding and the appreciation that we create our own destiny and we create our own experience. It is possible for us to transform this world with the resources and the technology that we have on hand right here and right now. There is nothing missing, there is nothing lacking, and to be quite honest, there is really nothing to be fixed. The world is unfolding in its perfection and it is our job and our intention to help speed this evolution of consciousness up to develop and bring forward a greater idea for humanity. And that greater idea is to create and bring into being a world that works for everyone. We know that we can do this using the same spiritual principles that have been used throughout the entire eons of the world itself. Every spiritual denomination has essentially taught the same thing and brought forward the same ideas. And it is our job to be able to bring that forward in our spiritual communities throughout the world, in our teaching centers, in every aspect and every way that we can. We are dedicated to this concept and we have dedicated our lives to doing this and bringing this forward and creating this and making this manifest in our world. There is no longer any reason for people to go without food, for people to go without water, for people to be in, put into a position where they live in fear and that they live in a way that blocks them from being their true and authentic selves. We here believe that this change can take place by simply providing an idea that is larger than the idea that we already have held in our society and to be able to make it manifest. As such, we recognize and know that the greatest obstacle that we have to this is fear. And so I would just like to share honestly and openly that fear is something that is man-made. It is not something that is spiritually divine. And I uh, understand and appreciate and come from a place of recognition that if one follows the teaching clearly, one recognizes and knows that fear is something that is merely put forward in order to be able to block and prevent us from our greatest good. For we believe in a spirit and believe in a power and a God that is for goodness and goodness only. With this recognition in mind, I know that as we move forward and we cast behind us those ideas that somehow or other we're not enough, those ideas that somehow or other we don't have enough, those ideas that somehow or other the world is not enough, that what we can do is we can move forward with a new idea and with a new pledge to the world itself and create heaven on earth right here and right now. Centers for Spiritual Living is dedicated to this concept and to this idea. We are dedicated to this philosophy. Our teacher Ernest Holmes uh, taught us that the world is created through our own concepts and our own ideas, through our own mind, and that it's possible if we were to enlarge that mind, enlarge those ideas, to be able to transform and attract to us the world that we all desire and the world that we all seek. That world is a world that works for everyone. Thank you.